Hi, hi, this is Christine Blackledge here and I'd like to talk to you about some steps which you can take in starting your healthcare business. I've given you some examples of what I did to achieve my goals of getting to where I wanted to be to start my own healthcare businesses and I set up multiple ones. So some of the things which I used to do is I would have to get up four o'clock in the morning before the whole household got up. Having four children is not easy when you're trying to set up a business and I can understand where you must be coming from and how you must be feeling right now. What obstacles are in your way stopping you from achieving your goal of starting a healthcare business? We all want to leave a legacy for our family, our loved ones. And, you know, just planning and making some changes to enable us to be able to do that. Another thing I did, another tip, is that I stopped watching the soaps on TV. I mean, yes, we've got Netflix now as well. And we've got Facebook. You imagine the time we spend on Facebook each day, two hours, up to four hours a day, that we can use that time to work on our business. That's another avenue. Think about where the time is that you could actually pull back to get your business started. Another aspect is that I would do batch cooking where I would cook food for five days at a time so that when the children came home from school, I was able to give them still a nice healthy meal, but I wasn't cooking for hours trying to prepare a meal. So that cut down for me, it cut down an hour and a half cooking, for example. So there's things that you can do to enable you to get to the goal where you want to. And I'm not on about interfering in your work life where you're being paid. Some of you may be working from home. So use your commute time to work on your business. And with there's lots of things that you can sit down and write down and think, where can I get this time to make a start on my business and get it set up and, and, and run it? You know, we're, we're in 2021 now. Anything is possible now. We're in such a strong position. And for you to be able to, for example, run a race, or to win a race, you need to prepare for that and plan how best you're going to do it. You need to eat the right food. You need to practice in order for that day of when you need to win that race. And it's the same for in business as well. And I just wanted to touch base on that and to give you some tips which you can do to enable you to get your business started. Of course, we do our boot camps as well, but we've got our free web classes as well. And I just want you to make a plan, get an action plan together and write what it is that you need to do where are you going to get that time? What time are you going to create with you? Make a date with yourself of when you're going to work on your business and this will help bring you closer to your goal. I hope that served you well. I hope that that's resonated with you. 